All right, everybody, I'm going to try this. This will show if I'm going to be able to listen and do it. I feel led to do or not, but I went came on here last week, and I was just now brave enough to get on here again. Believe it or not, as much as I to cut up with all y'all, and y'all never know what's going to come out of my mouth, getting in front of a video camera or even getting in front of people unless I'm singing, uh-uh. I ain't all about that. But I did have a question that I wanted to address, and it's a simple question. It's just a question I didn't see coming, and that was, why do I see you wearing hats all the time now? Well, I was, I don't know if y'all know a lot about pots, so let me back up and say, with pots, it means your pulse and uh, your your heart rhythm will go up and down, up and down, or stay low, or just go really high. You never would know what it's going to do. But one of the side effects is being intolerant to the heat and the cold. And I could not walk from the... I live in South Georgia. I could not walk from my back porch to my shed. No lie. So, I got to thinking, I don't like people telling me that I can't do something... So I started putting on hats. You know how easy it is to put on a hat? Should be real easy. You don't even have to worry about your hair. You put the hat on. You go outside. You're good. And you can't stay out there long. But it, at least it gets you from one place to the other. You don't feel like you're going to pass out if you park in the parking lot and can't even make it in into where you're going. So that's why you've seen me with hats. But I said I'd help y'all. I have a huge question. Where do you find nice hats? Just everyday hats. That's not huge. I can't find one to fit my head. They are, um, my head feels swallowed in them. But it works. And if I want to take the time or if I feel like 